Oh. out here uh, with the uh, V4 Creighton again um, I went ahead and decided to go ahead and uh, do some upgrades on it go ahead and get her uh, Goliath up for one thing got the M2C uh, Goliath chassis on it which uh, she was needing that because it was uh, pretty much twisting up after every bash um, and, and also a big uh, shout out to uh, Lee Wood from uh, custom RC upgrades uh, from the uh, Facebook uh, U or uh, the Arma UK Facebook group um, he sent me these uh, uh, chassis braces here and the uh, spindles for the uh, brace stopper and also it may be hard to see but the uh, steering rack right there uh, these are really nice parts um, i'm really impressed with them they got a nice cutout right there for the drive shaft i'm not sure if you guys can see this uh, the chassis braces are 6082 uh, t6 aircraft aluminum and the uh, steering uh, plate is 7075 so they, they do look really nice i did cut it i did go ahead and put in the uh, bolt right here at the top plate um, drill out for that so Anyway, um, I do have uh, hot racing and a couple hot racing goodies on it, the uh, rear suspension mount. I did have the uh, upper suspension mount right there too. I just haven't put yeah, it on. Also, I'll put a link for uh, the website for custom RC upgrades uh, down in the, in the uh, description, so you guys check it out. Um, it is out of the UK, but he does. He's got shock towers, uh, uh, all the braces, all kinds of goodies, and they're, they're really nice, really nice looking parts. So, all right, let's see what's up. Oh! Ooh, she shut off on me. It's kind of a weird sound. <laughs> Check that out, guys. I got a rock stuck in my battery tray, which is rubbing up against the spur gear. <laughs> I'm making a god awful whining, whining noise. <laughs> I almost hit my ramp. <laughs> <laughs> that was a hard landing. Oh! <laughs> check the temps real quick i'm running a uh, 16 tooth pinion but these uh you know these bigger tires and it's still 95 degrees out it's like eight o'clock at night but it's still in the 90s so we'll see what the yeah we got about one about 180 ish on the can there about one about 120 on the ESC, so I'm gonna let her cool down a second. Oh look, just scored a big pile of sand. <laughs> I do believe that unplugged it. That almost got ugly. Oh, <laughs> we scored. Uh 
Oh, right on the fence. That was close. Yeah, guys, it's always a good thing to stop about halfway through and check your screws because I had a screw backing out right here. Uh, looks like yeah for the battery tray, but that that screw will snag stuff and snag the ramps and all that and, and do a lot of damage. Either rip it out or cause damage to your ramps. So always check on your screws. <laughs> yeah, guys, I might need to move my truck. <laughs> Hey guys, these run-ups are really tricky because this big gravel right here is really hard to navigate in. It constantly wants to throw your truck off. Oh! <laughs> she bounced and went upside down. Oh boy. <laughs> Ramp shaver. I came out to this other little spot that's right down the street from my house uh, just to kind of let the truck cool off a little bit. She was starting to get hot again. Uh, I'm just going to rip around and run the rest of this pack out. Got some nice little natural flowing hills here. That was kind of rough. Had a brain fart. Ended up tapping the brake instead of the gas. And she dug a crater right there. That'll be a good test. That was LVC, or she just thermaled. Oh yeah, I'm up over 200 on the can. We're going. <laughs> we're definitely going to go ahead and call it. That's some pretty running hard out in this grass. All right, she seemed to do very well. Uh, again, a uh, big shout out to uh, Custom RC like Upgrades. Everything held up. Everything's still snug. Nothing looks bent. The chassis looks uh, bone straight. And uh, there was no brakes as far as I could see. So it just shows you what just what just a couple uh, key upgrades will do without going crazy, doing all kinds of stuff. I mean, you know, I recommend the chassis, the uh, chassis braces, and then like the rear and uh, upper suspension mounts. I mean, that's 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 definitely some of the key things that, that you need to do, you know, for really hard bashing. But anyway, all right, guys, it was a blast. V4 Creighton's a beast. Until next time, Marcy Dude 81. Peace out.